Now, Ethiopia and Eritrea have opened a new chapter. The leaders of the two countries met at, their la at the later latter's capital, Asmara, earlier in the week and agreed to normalize the long broken relations. The development brought with it uh, the resumption of phone services between the two countries. Now, relatives and friends are speaking directly to each other and mending relations too. CGTN's Gerum Chala with more. Groom nang ye kadzawa kadzawa groom nang dene Ah yo jili dana ne Ah dana ne dana ne sala mo No darling thank you batam Well there you go um the relationship between Ethiopia and Eritrea has been something remarkable in this African continent these are uh, one people, two countries. Telephone communications between Ethiopia and Eritrea were cut off almost 20 years ago. Families had almost no way to communicate one another until now. The prefix number, which is 291 from Eritrea, and the prefix number of Ethiopia, 251, was blocked. And now immediately we unblock this thing and then we connect. And the interconnect is extremely, almost, it's, it's working in a good way. The resumption of the phone service has excited many here. People were even calling random numbers at Asmara to speak to Eritreans. There was a big excitement. Everybody was trying to call directly. And my team is also, they were working 24 by 7 to make this thing okay and then to make the connectivity very fine then of course there is a satellite communication and the interconnect we goes through the third party so my technical team myself were on board and uh, I, I can't express my, my my feeling I'm very much happy with the, the what we call it uh, the result that we see because of our Prime Minister there is more Ethiopian Airlines will resume its uh, flights to Eritrea in few days time the airline is the first flight to asmara will be made using the state-of-the-art boeing's 787 dreamliner plane et hopes the resumption of flights to eritrea will be historic and will help to quickly bring the people of ethiopia and eritrea back together again etio telecom 2 sees even more opportunities with its uh, service continuation with Eritrea. We have our, what you call it, the uh, international gateway. So we have uh, three gateways. And uh, of course, we start the fourth gateway through uh, Somali. Of course, we have through Djibouti, through Sudan, and through Kenya. Now we would like to work the international gateway through uh, Eritrea as well. Eritrea's President Isaias Afforgi is expected to visit Ethiopia soon. His visit, according to observers, will cement the already started peaceful process. These are exciting times for both Ethiopia and Eritrea. Groom Tara CGTN, Addis Ababa, Ethiopia.